Hi everyone, uh, in today's video we are exploring the Gemini CLI, Google's new command line interface that brings the power of no need for complex APIs or cloud consoles. So in short, the Gemini CLI turns your command line into an AI workspace. So we'll look at few basic uh, use cases through Gemini. Uh, you can install uh, Gemini through terminal. I'm using uh, Mac. Uh, let's start with uh, assessing the repository. I've downloaded one of the code for my application on the local machine and let's see if we can read the structure of the code and it suggests anything and it's asking uh, part to the project's root directory uh, yep and so it's analyzing the report repository and obviously it will examine its structure and dependencies and it's listing down that the application is built with node.js byte and tailwind css the configuration file starting with package json uh, it has completed the anal analysis of the repository as a summary of its architecture main modules and dependencies right so listing down the framework which i've used it's it's dive into the project in itself security features and it's giving me the security related aspects of the code base done uh, the authentication and authorization for the app and it's listed down what's missing so there is no explicit csrf protection particular build what's missing in the security layout of this Applicate. I can certainly help you with that. I'll focus on implementing two security enhancements, the Tom sanitization to prevent XSS and the content security policy. And it also has created a new utility function. You can use this function to sanitize any user generated content before rendering it as an HTML, right? And it's giving the example usage, uh, how we want to utilize it in our project. Um, it has added also a restrictive CSP to the index.html file. This, so this is how you can uh, analyze your code repository. You can find the gaps, improvements, and you need to implement those changes. This is one of the use cases. I think there are multiple uh, use cases that we can use. Let's use a more social use case. Um, let's analyze the latest AI news. Uh, let's see it's creating a linkedin content which is obviously less than 3000 characters uh, what it turns out so it's a basic uh, llm response uh, which is showing uh, and it's also highlighting the three key trends right and it's also scoring those news based on what context we provided right let's create a script to post this automatically linkedin account so obviously a LinkedIn, uh, to automatically post it, you need a LinkedIn API and it's creating a Python script to do this. Multiple use cases you can run through. To know more, please comment Gemini and I'll send details on your DM.